Okay, so this is where you go into Wix.com and when it's time for you to get your payment information in, um, it would be nice if you could go here and then enter your billing and payment information, but you can't do that. You have to purchase something and then it will save it in that area. So um, the other thing is, is you don't want to go into manage site. Uh, you could probably get away with it, but when you're here, you go to domains and mailboxes, you hit manage, hit buy a new domain name, and this is gonna this is an official um, search engine for domain names. It'll let you know if it's available in the market or not. So enter that in. It shows that it's available. I say get it. And then they always give you this option. It's kind of a no-brainer option. And so I always pick that one uh, just to upgrade. And then this is also a very obvious uh, situation. You, know, you can look through them. But um, the reason this is most popular is it makes the most sense. And if, if it ends up being where you need more of an e-commerce site, you can do that. But if you're not selling anything specifically... Um, you can go here if you're, you know, trying to book things and have some of those type of uh, e-commerce widgets. Then, then you probably end up here. So, once you select that, um, then you figure out how you want to pay. So, if you select one of these, it's gonna have you paying more money now, and you get, you know, cumulatively, you're getting a break per month. But if you would rather just be month to month, you just pay a little bit more. And so you would select that and then you see your money that you pay now is $16 versus 200 and some odd dollars. So, you know, that's your choice. Figure out which one works best for you. Enter your payment information in here and you're all set. The um, step after that is connecting the domain name to the site that's been built for you. If you're into computers, you're welcome to do that. You know, if you know your way around, otherwise it's something I'm I'm happy to go in um, after the purchase has been made. And that's something I can handle for you. So hope this helps. I appreciate it.